with my friend Chip. You hear that? That happens every time someone is having so much fun. The gong sounds. We have been following Kukaloo's trail we found and going on all the rides. And next up is the Fun Droparama. I can't wait. Me neither. Let's go. Um, are you sure you want to go on that ride? It has the longest line of any ride in all of Fun Mountain. Mm. It's just that, well, the thing is, you see, I, I really don't like waiting. But Callie, we have to ride all the rides and it is the next one. And while we're waiting in line, we can remember the rides we've been on and how we all scream together. And then we can laugh together. And then we talk about the funny faces we made on the ride together. Well, it's just that I think I'm ready to ride now. I don't want to wait. But Callie, who knows? Maybe waiting will help us be ready to ride the fun drop rama at just the right time. Well, maybe. I guess it does drop and then drop and then drop again. We'll need to be ready for that. Yeah, Callie, we'll wait in line and then we'll be ready for all the drops on the fun drop -arama. Okay, well, why do you think that waiting in line will make us ready to ride at just the right time? Hmm, that's a good question. I need to think about this while we check out our Bible story for today. John was a man who was sent by God to prepare the way for Jesus. When Jesus found out that John was in prison, he left home and went to a place called Galilee. It was the right time for Jesus to tell people about God and how they could know God more. It was also time for Jesus to find followers to learn more from him and to someday do what he did. One day, Jesus was walking by the lake and saw Peter and Andrew fishing. Jesus told them to stop fishing and follow him. And they did. Next, Jesus found James and John. They were fishing too. The same thing happened. Jesus told them to follow him and they did. God had prepared Jesus, that means made him ready, to begin to teach and heal. And Peter, Andrew, James, and John followed close behind watching and learning from everything Jesus did. This story reminds us that God makes us ready at the right time. Whoa, God had prepared Jesus to be ready at just the right time. Yeah, God makes us ready at the right time. And one of the things that made Jesus ready was that he wasn't alone. He had Peter, Andrew, James, and John with him. Wait, that gives me an idea. Hey, Callie, while you're waiting in line, will you be alone? No, no, I won't. That's it. That's why waiting will make us ready, because I will be with you and we'll wait together. Wow! I think you might be right. I think, I think, I think I'm ready to wait for just the right time. Yeah, let's go. Fun drop -arama, here we come. Hands up, hands down. Now turn yourself around. Hands up, hands down. Now turn yourself around. Hands up, hands down. Now turn yourself around. They say you're short, too tall. You try and give your all. And then sometimes you fall. Oh man, that can't make sense at all. But God directs us. Yes, He loves us. We can follow Jesus because He leads us. You're growing bigger and so much stronger. God has this message for you, you should consider. You measure up. You measure up. You measure up, up. You measure up. 